The Renewable City Strategy is a vision for the future of Vancouver where we rely 100% on renewable energy to power our city before 2050. Transportation uses a quarter of the energy that's used in the city of Vancouver. So we really want to reduce the amount of energy that's used in transportation and ultimately just increase the amount of renewable energy that we use. A complete compact community is the kind of place where people can live close to where they might work, where they play, and they have options to get around. So walking, cycling, taking transit. By opening up these choices to people and by reducing the distances that people have to travel, we can reduce our use of fossil fuels. Living in this neighborhood near Commercial Drive has been life-changing. Everything is at my fingertips. Schools, grocery stores, restaurants, the community center, and there's the beach. So I can have anything I want just a few blocks away from me. We've got tremendous demand for transit use from our citizens as well as from visitors and the thousands of people that work in Vancouver. So it's really important that we add additional capacity and also extend the system. Me and Gus will use transit to come home from work and daycare. He's constantly exploring and it's such a social experience for us. Transit connects you to your city and can really open up things like housing options. It's really important for thinking about the future. More electric vehicles are coming on the market and as the battery technologies are maturing as well, the prices are coming down. And the city is working on a strategy to significantly increase the number of charging stations in Vancouver. Having an electric car is amazing. I could never go back to a regular gas car. It's so smooth to drive, there's almost no maintenance. Every day you come home, you just plug the car in, and when you wake up in the morning, you have a full range, and you get used to that sense of just quiet. Mobility pricing is charging for car trips, such as a bridge toll. You can relate that directly to the cost of a transit trip versus the cost of a bike trip or walking. Car sharing is a great option to have. I don't use them every day. I use them when it makes the most sense. So if I want to bike to work one day and I get tired, decide I don't want to bike home, I can just put my bike on the Evo and drive home. and deliver services effectively and efficiently. It's going to be paramount that we better manage commercial transportation. The city can support the local production and distribution of goods so that we're minimizing the need for large-scale, long-distance transportation. You know, we're very aware of our routing. Making sure Many of our businesses are very, very keen on looking at transportation and what a low-carbon economy could look like. We've had a lot more discussions around electric cars as there's some larger, heavier duty models that are starting to hit the marketplace. By pursuing renewably powered transportation, we will improve the quality of life and, of course, the environment. Ultimately, this is about making Vancouver a better place for all of us. <laughs>